Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. On this video we'll be taking you for a bit of a tour inside the Colosseum. Rome is a wonderful city and as you can see everywhere you walk there's a beautiful architectural structure with an amazing history behind it. As we stroll on the streets towards the Colosseum, we find ourselves surrounded by incredible constructions that have been around for over a thousand years. Going to the Colosseum. Wow. The Colosseum, finally we're there. This marvel of ancient Roman engineering is over 1900 years old. It was built as part of an imperial effort to revitalize Rome, and it took seven to eight years to build. The Colosseum's outer walls are covered in three levels of Doric, Ionic and Corinthian columns and each level has 80 arches. Of these, 70 things are numbered with Roman numerals still visible above them in some places. The Colosseum was built with an estimated 100,000 cubic meters of travertine stone. The stones was held together by thousands of iron clamps. Here are some interesting facts we learned on the day. Uh, did you know that the thumb down gesture never existed? In a gladiator's battle, the fate of the gladiator that lost wasn't decided by the emperor, it was decided by the crowd. The Colosseum could sit between 50,000 and 80,000 spectators. In the underground of the Colosseum was an elaborate network of tunnels and chambers where gladiators, animals and prisoners were kept before entering the arena. It is impossible to know with certainty how many people died in the Colosseum, but it is believed that as many as 400,000 between gladiators, slaves, convicts and prisoners. After ceasing to be used as an arena for compact and hunts, at different points in history the Colosseum has been used as a cemetery, a place of worship, 
for housing, the home of a religious order, a fortified castle, and most recently an asset tourist attraction. The Colosseum receives over 4 million visitors every year. The Colosseum is the most popular attraction in Italy and one of the most popular in the world. Okay, we just finished the Colosseum. I hope you have enjoyed that video. We're on our way to have something to eat for lunch. We're starving. The rain has been awesome. It didn't rain at all. We've been announced storms and everything, but we, we dodged it. So we were able to really get a grasp of what the Colosseum was all about. All I can say is if you were deciding to come to the Colosseum, you want to do it, yes, yes, do it 100%. I recommend you do it. The video will give you an idea, but the feeling you get of walking in there and knowing the, the history, tour, yeah, and that's another good advice, book the tour because it's you're going to learn. Fun. You're going to learn a lot about the history of the Colosseum, which is not just, it's nothing shown on the movies that we watch sometimes. Although I did speak to a couple of, of the tour guys and they said to me that the Gladiator movie with Russell Crowe is one that comes to the closest of the truth of what being a gladiator back in those days were about. So guys, don't forget to subscribe. There will be a lot more videos coming your way from Italy and anywhere we go in the world with Hiles. See ya! Bye!